Hey guys, what's up? Anyway, this is the end result of this video. Um, basically spawning or rather uh, converting a WMO, a garrison WMO from uh, 6x to 3x rather Lich King. And uh, yeah, I've been getting a lot of PMs lately from people on like Minecraft, on AC Web, on YouTube and such uh, ask, asking how to convert uh, garrisons. Um, I'm not sure why that's such a big deal. Uh, then again, I'm not. I'm not, I'm not that kind of a person. Like I, I do those maps and whatever comes on it, I'm satisfied with. Uh, but uh, yeah, so this will run through on how to convert this particular WMO, which is, I believe, I forgot the file name, but it doesn't matter. I'll, I'll cover it right after this intro. Um, but yeah, I don't show like how to set it up in the game or nothing like that. Just how to convert the WMO. I already have the DBC file to spawn it and such as a game object. And I already have the M2s pulled and converted, and all, all the textures pulled and such. It's just convert. It's it's just uh, going over how to convert the uh, the WMO itself and such. And this is ground here, which doesn't work because I, I I didn't punch a hole through the ground. So it is what it is. That's what it is. All right. So uh, that's pretty much that. Uh, thanks for checking this out. Hopefully this helped you guys out. And uh, yeah. All right. Bye bye. Alright, for some reason people have been contacting me about converting problems with uh, with Adreno or Garrisons. So this is just to address it to all those people that are asking me about it. Um, yeah, alright, so let's just get to it. I'm just going to show you guys how to do one. And it's I'm I'm just gonna do it from scratch. So I'm it's it's I'm I'm not gonna show you straightforward. I'm just gonna show you in parts. And it's gonna air. It's gonna crash. Wow! But I'll show you how to get around it and why it crashes. Okay, it's just the way how Rack Rack Lich King is made, and you just have to follow suit. All right, that's pretty much it. So the one I'm gonna be doing is this one here. It's a uh, Garrison Barracks V3. All right, so I'm gonna spawn this. So I'm gonna do the dot G object. Uh, 50028 it's gonna crash because whatever all right there we go crash so it's in my folder here and I'm just gonna I'm going to attempt to uh, to patch it all right to convert them whatever <coughs> okay so first I want to get to my root file which should be over here somewhere over here uh, apply the template Go to the T mom uh, and then uh, look for any flags that are out of bounds, anything higher than six. If they're higher than six, get them and change them to something else, like six or five or something. All right. So there's another one that's 13. Go to this one, this is six. Another one here, this one here. You gotta just do that until you're done. Anything that's higher than six, make it a six or a five or whatever. Uh, play around with it, see what works best for you. And that's it. Save that one out, that's done. Next, I want to go into all the several individual files. All right, so here I just want to take out the S-bombs. All right, so take that out. So search for that, delete it. It's basically up to the S-bomb to the next chunk. So select all that, take it out, so on and so forth. Search. All right. And search again. Take it out. All right. Now these two last files, I believe they don't have an S bomb, so I'll skip that for now. It's still gonna wire out, but yeah. All right. So, yeah, and then other people have commented saying something like. Uh, like how this one here has this LDOM, LPOM, or some other one at the very bottom has. Uh, this one doesn't have it. Um, this file probably has it. Uh, yeah, there's this uh, LADM or MDLM, whatever you want to say it. But that's not needed. You don't have to do anything with this because this is at the very bottom. The, the, the reason why we have to take out the S bomb is because while Wrath is looking for a, a mod R directly after a mob A, all right? So if, since the S-bomb is always, or technically mob S, it's it's always after the, the uh, mob A, um, 
um, and Wrath is looking for a, a mod R, uh, that's why you have to take it out so that it will actually read in order and find what it is looking for. If you don't, then you, then you get an error. Okay, so that's basically why, why we just why we take it out because while reads it in a very consecutive order if it hits something that it's not supposed to it doesn't know what to do it crashes all right and this doesn't use a a address or or a setter a header to figure out where everything is at it just reads it down one by one boom 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 if it boom 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 and it hits a wall well it crashes so there you go so let's go back into the game and I think I was on this character. So he's still gonna crash, all right? So what we need to do is uh, notice how all these other ones, right? And if I go all the way to the top, let me use one that doesn't have that uh, LEM, unless they all have it. It seems like they all have it. <coughs> yeah, okay. So it doesn't matter. Uh, if you notice all their chunks, they have this M-O-P-Y or Y-P-O-M if you want to read it backwards. So uh, let me just go down to the next section. All right, then it has the I-V-O-M. Then, then go down to the next section. Uh, this one has a, uh, a T-V-O-M, one T-V-O-M right there. So go down to the next section. Six, three, oops, uh, one, 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 two. All right, and then this one has a R-N-O-M. The, the, what I'm typing in is basically from after after the chunk name will be four bytes of the size of, of the chunk. So if I click here, right, it basically it's this right here, these four digits here. All right, if I pump, I'll put my mouse there, if I look over here to what says unsigned int, all right, it'll give me the size, 163116. And what I'm doing is basically pushing this key shortcut to select the range. And I will take this number and I will punch it into here and plus four to it so one six three one twenty when you plus four and then, and then you move on to the next section all right then it has this uh this vtom and whatever and then so on and so forth and then and then you eventually get to an a bomb all right and after the a bomb is this r dom and and the s bomb was between this before so that's why you it would crash because you it doesn't know what the fuck an s bomb is all right so that's why you have to take it out so it just keeps on reading down the line now with that said, these are all here for a particular reason. And remember, what I just keep saying over and over, it all reads in a line. It has to read it, read it in that order. Now, if you have some WMOs that don't have these chunks in a particular order, it's going to crash. All right? So, enter this WMO. Notice how it doesn't have any of that shit. Okay? It just has this LPOM. Mm -hmm. No, no, no Moppy, no Movi, no... No, no, t -bomb, no nothing, all right, just that. So you have to enter those in. So if you want this, this WMO, which I think is just collision, that's probably it. It's it's probably just collision or just nothing at all, or just something that WAD uses now. Um, you have to basically put those things in if you want this particular uh, WMO to pass. Okay, so we have to go back here and look where the Moppy comes in. Right. and so on and so forth all right there should be a list right here from the pxr website it's kind of down right now so i'm using a, a google cache to uh, view it uh backup and uh, i made a save for it just in case the backup does get overridden by the blank but um because if you try to go through the regular website uh it's probably still blank yeah it's still still blank all right so until they fi they figure out what went wrong there and what what uh, what accident happened um then well you gotta use a cache or hopefully you can just look up from this video but these are basically in this order is what things have to come in as all right so if there's something missing if there's if there's something skipped or not there you got to put it in otherwise it's gonna just crash all right so uh, you can make a list of these and then and, and you just make them in order as you go just to check and such so like I can get rid of a notepad and paste these in just to have it or actually I don't, I, I don't even have to do that I can just open up a, a, a script window and just paste this in and uh, yeah just in case I accidentally hit something I want to just put this into a comment into a comment just in case I do something stupid 
All right, so this is always there, and I could just look at it this way, right? So, I, I like uh, so it it comes in at this address here, which is what five eight. Yeah, so five eight is where this comes in. You go to the moppy, and then you look down here. This position eighty eight decimal fifty eight hex. Okay, so I want to go to fifty eight hex, which is where this L pawn is at. All right, from here I just want to do a uh, a, uh, a control shift I to uh, to insert bytes. I want to insert. Um, it's missing all of them, so each one will take up. Uh, eight bytes all right so this one two three four five six seven all right so seven times eight is uh 56 all right and make sure it's decimal if, if it's hex you're gonna have to click decimal click cancel re put your mouse there re control shift i and whatever for it to reset all right so i'm gonna do 56 hit insert it's gonna insert shit all right from here i'm just going to click on here make sure i'm at still at 58 I'm gonna type in the uh this, oh, it wasn't 56 because this one wasn't. I already have that one. That's the main one. So it's just here, but I just delete the other eight, whatever's left. All right. So I'm going to type in a Y, P, O, M. All right. Go, go by four bytes. One, two, three, four. Type in the next one. I, V, O, M. One, two, three, four. T, V, O, M. One, two, three, four. R, N, O, M. One, two, three, four. Yeah, ooh, wrong one. Uh, don't push delete. If you mess up, don't push delete. Push your back key and just overwrite it. If you push delete, you'll take it away and probably resize the file and screw shit up. All right. So uh, after R num is uh, V T O M and then A B O M. All right. And if you want, you can just for the help. Sometimes you need it in there for some reason, even though if you don't use it, the R dom. So which is the next one that would like follow? Uh, go away. Which sometimes it's it's it's, it's Arlom or uh, Molar, whatever. Or yeah, and and then the, that one. But uh, yeah, I, I usually just put that one because this is for if if it has like doodads or like game objects. If it if if it has any, that's what would go here. That this is what what we we'll, would we'll call it. But. Uh, yeah, don't don't really need it because the flag's not set for it. But uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take that out. Sometimes you have to put it in for some reason, even if the flag isn't set for it. The flag for it is basically if this right here, not this two, but this zero here on this right side for the D for for the one D uh, section, the second byte. If it's an eight like that, all right, or anything higher than an eight, then you need a you you need a. a, a R down, all right, or the mod R, whatever. But since it's not like that, I don't need it. Just hit save. Let's move on to the next one. So what are we missing from here? All right, so let's just go through it, all right? So this one has a Mobi. This one has a. This one does not. This one has a Movi and a Mov T. All right, so let's have a mod R. This one's really small, so I could just scroll through it by hand, or not. <laughs> So 364. Alright, so this one has an Arnon, that's cool, and a Viton, and a Dokarasa, cool, and no A bomb. Right, no A bomb. So you have to add the A bomb. So that's basically it. So just control shift I and then add eight. Alright, insert. Go here, type in uh, A bomb, save, set, go into the game. And let it load and once I go back in there should be no error because that's all you have to do is just put in whatever's not there all right this is it oh wrong character hey 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 oh wrong 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 wow now no whoa, whoa. <laughs> it's this one okay and then let's see this guy no error! I gotta get out of the ground. But as you can see, it works now. So that's basically how you would convert garrison models, among other things that are just missing shit. So, yeah.
All right. See you guys later. Bye-bye. Ciao.